Snooty. A woman is raped by a Milwaukee police officer after calling 911, and tonight she's suing the city. That officer is now in prison, but that's not the end of the story. Our Jenna Sachs is live with the latest on this. Jenna. The victim's attorney says not only was she raped by a Milwaukee police officer, she was arrested and detained, though she would never be charged with the crime. During that time, she says she told several officers that she had been raped, but they did not believe her. She can't trust the police, and she's terrified all the time. In July 2010, Officer Ladmerald Cates responded to a 911 call on North 15th Street in Milwaukee. There, a 19 year old woman had called police to report neighbors throwing rocks through her windows. When Cates arrived, he raped her in her home. She comes running out of her house saying, I've been raped. I've been raped by a police officer. At that point, the response of the Milwaukee Police Department is to arrest her. The victim's attorney says the woman told police officers at District 3 about the rape, but they did not believe her. She complained while she was being fingerprinted. She was crying. She was hysterical. I've been raped. I've been raped by a police officer. Their response was to throw her into a cell for 11 hours. The lawsuit says when the woman was taken to the hospital, a nurse found evidence of strangulation and sexual assault. Cates was fired from the Milwaukee Police Department in December 2010. He was convicted by a federal court of sexual assault in January 2012. Thursday, the victim filed a suit against Cates, the city of Milwaukee, and Chief Ed Flynn. We investigated the case. Uh, we made a finding and terminated his employment. We referred it to prosecution. He was successfully prosecuted on the basis of our investigation, and he's now in jail. Uh, beyond that, I really can't comment. Rape is a crime of power, and it's Chief Flynn in the city of Milwaukee that invested that officer with the power. And their response is too little, too late, and an embarrassment. Cates is serving a 24-year prison sentence. The Justice Department called this a heinous crime and a civil rights violation. Chief Flynn says he can't comment any further because this is an ongoing suit. Reporting live in Milwaukee, Jenna Sachs, Fox 6 News. Thank you, Jenna. Police say this man, 54-year-old Anthony Davis,